there, my name's Andy Hillier, and today's guitar lesson is gonna be on My Maria by Brooks and Dunn. It's a cool track, it's great fun to play on the guitar, and I'm gonna teach you the whole song. But just before I do, if you wouldn't mind subscribing to my channel, which is Andy Hillier, give me a like on the video, leave me some comments in the comment section, including what songs I should do next. And if you love what I'm doing, you wanna support me, and you wanna print the tabs off for this, then I'll put them on my Patreon page. I'll leave a link to that in the description. My guitar is in standard tuning, uh, so I'm gonna play it in standard tuning today, but on the record, they play it down a semitone, so they tune all their strings down one semitone. Uh, so if you wanna play along to the track, you gotta tune down half a step or a semitone. Uh, but I'm in standard tuning today to make it easy. All right, okay, the song starts with an intro, which sounds like this. So to play that, we're gonna start with an open E string. And then a quick slide in from fret three, just into fret four on the E string. So I'm using my third finger to do that slide really quick. So you don't really hear the three, just hear the four sliding in. And then play D2. And it comes in on beat three and. So one, two, three. And then you can play an open E string in bar two. And then we've got a B chord which is your first finger, A2, and your third finger across the D, G, and the B strings at the fourth fret. If you struggle to do that full B chord, you could just play the A2 and the D4, and just play those two notes. But if you can, get the rest of those strings in. So from the beginning, you've got. And then we're gonna do an A chord, but just play it with your first finger flat. So your first finger flat across the D2, and the G2, and maybe the B2 as well, but it doesn't really matter. And you're gonna play from the A string downwards, and then we're gonna hit it again in the next bar. So from the beginning, you've got. Then an open A string, and then a slide from A2 to A4. Again, it's a quick slide, so you don't really hear the two so much and then play D2. And then that same slide from E3 to E4, and then play the D2 again. So you got. So the whole line slowly goes one, two, three. Up speed. And then bars th um, two and three repeat. So you play them twice. So the whole line, the whole intro will go. So that's the intro. It then goes to the verse, which sounds like this. So it's almost the same, slight little change. We've got an open E string, and then we're hitting like an E chord, so first finger on D1, second finger on A2, third finger D2. So you play the E string, and then you play it as a chord. And then the B chord, and then the A chord again, twice, exactly like we did before, and then it's the same ending that we had before. So only a slightly little change that we've got that extra E chord in there at the beginning. So slowly you've got up speed. And that repeats around eight times. And that takes us to the chorus. Now there's two lines of the chorus and it sounds like this. Okay, so to play that, open E chord, and then a B chord, we can do it on an upstroke. And then another B chord. Again, you could just play the A2 and D2. But if you can't get it all in, then it sounds cooler. And then it goes to an A chord on the offbeat. So that first bar of the chorus goes. 
then don't play the notes in the brackets there, just hold on. We're gonna play another A chord after that. And then an E chord. And then up, down. So slowly, the first two bars of that chorus go. Then A. Then B on an upstroke. A on an upstroke. And then E on an upstroke, we're gonna go up. And then up, down, up, down. So if I play bars uh, eight and nine together, we get. So the whole line slowly. And up speed, one, two, three, four. On to the next line of the chorus, and it's almost the same, so it starts the same. First two bars. And then into bar 12, and it just goes an A chord, down, up, up, up. And then hits an E chord, and does that same that we had like right in the beginning uh, and in the verse part. So open E, slide to E4, and then D2. So the whole of that line slowly goes, Speed. So let's just put the whole chorus together because it's two lines. Here we go. One, two, three, four. That will then go back and play the verse. And then after the second verse, there's a little bridge. It's the only bit that's slightly different, which goes. So to play that, we've got a B chord for a bar, then an A chord for a bar, and then rest on beat one, hit an E chord on beat two, then a B, and then an A. So the first three bars go one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, rest. E, B, A, 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 and then there's just like uh, five A's on there. And it repeats those two bars, and then it carries on, just plays an open E string, and then an E chord, and then B, A, so it goes. And then in the last bar, you just go. Uh, up, down, up, down, up. Uh, so hopefully that makes sense. So bars uh, 18 and 19 go. So the whole of that bridge goes one, two, three, four. then you just go back to the chorus till the end of the song. Well, I do hope you've enjoyed that little guitar lesson. If you have, if you wouldn't mind subscribing to my channel, which is Andy Hillier, it really does help me out. Give me a like on the video as well. And I love to hear from you. I do read every comment. Um, it's crazy that people are watching this all around the world. So please let me know where in the world you're from, uh, what you thought of the video, uh, and what songs I should do next. And if you love what I'm doing, you wanna support me, support the channel, and you wanna print the tabs off for this, then I'll put them on my Patreon page. I'll leave a link to that in the description. Well, thanks for watching this. I do appreciate it. I've been Andy Hillier, and I'll see you next time.